Welcome back to another Unturned video. Today I joined a full vanilla server and we're going to do an epic rex to riches that will lead into raiding really good base raids. If you guys enjoy these kind of Unturned videos, make sure to drop a like. Let's try to reach 180 likes. You guys are smashing each like goal and it's honestly amazing and thank you guys so much. Also, 71% of you guys watching this video right now are not yet subscribed, so I would really appreciate it if you hit that button. And finally, the winner of the mythical giveaway is Lukanzo. I used a random comment picker and this is the winner. If you're watching this video, please join my Discord and contact me there and let's get straight into the video all right joined a brand new vanilla server there are some people on the server there's a duo and then a bunch of solos i'm gonna try to get myself a better spawn close to seattle that's actually not that bad we're gonna loot seattle and then we'll probably head to military as always maybe we'll get ourselves the rex to riches or maybe i'll get killed or hopefully we'll find some good base raids oh let's go a blunt force perfect pretty good weapon in my opinion just looted seattle only got myself a blunt force but then i did get myself some clothes half of seattle was actually looted so we're gonna head straight over to military over there maybe we'll get ourselves a heartbreaker maybe some good military load if we don't we'll probably head over to heritage and over there we try to get ourselves a zubeknikov and if we don't again we'll just head straight back to military oh, well there are some cobra shots happening over at military there's a light as well now the easiest way for me to know where they are all right well, since i only have a blunt force i literally re need to be right in front of his face right, one of them's dead I only had a call. Wait, does he not realize that I've, I've killed one of them? Let me take his loot really quickly then. They're speaking in game. I don't think they have an idea that I've actually killed one of them. Shut the fuck up, zombie. Okay, well, he's talking with a zombie. Yeah, I don't think they have an idea that I'm here. Oh, damn, he's actually geared. All right, he's dead. He just kept staring at me. Oh, that's the geared. All right, picked up the saber tote. All right, he's dead. But I got, yeah, I got myself some easy load. Got myself two night vision, a fully decked out heartbreaker, a lease pack, a bunch of ammo. Let's take all of the load, the best load, and leave. Let's go check out what this guy over here has as well. Because I didn't really get to look at it. Oh, I didn't have anything. He had a cobra. I could take those though. All right, since I've got myself some decent loot, I'm gonna build myself a base. I wanna store all of this good loot that I have. Thankfully, I did get myself a fire axe, so it's gonna be that not that hard to chop down trees. It's not gonna take me an hour for each tree. And as soon as I finish a one by one, I'll try to make a bed. I'll try to make myself some storage, and then we'll continue looting kind of scared that they'll return they seemed like where they were a three-man team all right base is done got myself some crates now i need to go and get myself cloth to make myself a bed i could leave all of these items in here i've just looted heritage i should have got myself enough cloth in order to make a bed oh wait i heard some steps in here wait i think there's somebody oh pdw and my gun was on semi. All right, so for that day, I actually left the server. The server after that pretty much died out, and the guy that killed me pretty much left the server, so I did leave the server. And then I joined a couple of days later with a different character. I've been looting for a bit. I did get myself a saber tooth with a bunch of attachments. I got myself some ammo. Next, I'm gonna head over to Scorpion 7. I'm also sure that my one by one base did get traded. It's been like a week since I've joined this server, so I'm pretty sure that every single progress that I've had the other day, it's all gone, literally. I think there's somebody in here. Oh, the cabinets are open and I hear some steps. All right, and I killed him. He almost killed me as well. All right, he seems like he didn't have that much good loot. He has a peacemaker though. Peacemaker and a saber tooth and a viper. He has a blowtorch as well. I could put the bipod on this viper. Oh, there's a guy over there. I don't know if he saw me. I should be so low. Alright, he's dead finally. I had to waste a whole magazine on him. He has a heartbreaker and some clothes, rock explosive. I also had a fire axe. That's pretty good. We could maybe build a base then. Actually, that's what I'm going to do next. I'm gonna go build a base very close to here. Because I do have some guns that I don't really want to lose. So I've got myself a one by one base ready. Next, we're gonna have to make ourselves some storage, which shouldn't really be a problem because I still have some logs. We're gonna make a saw, make ourselves a bunch of planks. Now over here, we'll store extra guns, extra ammo, raw explosives, attachments, all of those. There is a guy over there, but I don't, I think he saw me actually. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he saw me. No, he definitely did. Maybe I could jump down and try to go from behind him. I right, hit him. Okay, he's dead. He almost killed me, actually. Oh, well, that was kind of scary. He had another fully decked out heartbreaker, another blowtorch. All right, let me med up as well, because this guy almost killed me. Well, there is a naked guy in here. He has a blowtorch, and I kind of want that. Heartbreaker shots at melee. Either they're PvPing or there's a mega zombie. Whatever it is, I'm going to go try to kill whoever is there. All right, well, I, I killed a zombie. All right, let's go push him really quickly. I think I hit him as well, so he must be pretty low. I don't know where he went. I think he's hiding in the in the room over there. I'm gonna go up the tower then. Oh, there he is. Yeah, he is in the room. He's hiding in the corner. 
Nah, he's dead, he's dead. Nah, he, he's actually geared. Spec Ops PDW, Chainsaw, Rock Explosives, two MREs as well, Bipod. Alright, well, I am full geared, so maybe a good idea would be to run back to base, depot, and then come back. We got a chainsaw so we could actually get logs very easily and even XP. Looks like I also found an unrated base. Two by two. Some of it is with metal, some of it is with wood. So once we get raiding gear, we'll definitely come back to this one. He's dead. He was trying to come up from behind me, man. He had a master key. Oh, there's a grizzly in here. I'll take that. Drop that heartbreaker. Get our first raiding weapon. And we are successfully back in base. I got all of this good load. Problem is, I don't have that much storage, actually. But I'll put the good items in there for now. We did get ourselves a bunch of extra weapons. And most importantly, we got ourselves a grizzly. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and harvest as much wood as possible. From those, I will make myself as much storage as possible. And maybe even upgrade the base. Because a 1x1 one one is very easy to get raided. So I have upgraded the base from a 1x1 one one to a 2x1. I did make myself a bunch of storage. Got myself some xp as well i'm gonna salvage this door to make it up front now we have ourselves a one by two let's go loaded the convoy for a bit got myself enough cloth to make myself a bed also got a high cow box from there so that's good there's a guy inside the car oh, he's dead this guy threw like a billion smokes as well he didn't even log the golf cart okay let's see he had oh, he had a charge what okay uh, he had a bunch of other random junk though i'll take that saber tooth as well there's a guy hiding down there hit him and he's dead. Oh, poor guy, he didn't have anything good except an ace and some food. Oh, and at least back, let's go. Ouch, oh, I'm getting shot at Saber Toad. Uh, I don't know from where, actually. Uh, he probably heard me shoot the other guy. He probably won't push me, though, if he's with a Saber Toad. Let me take out mine. I think I saw him. Yeah, he's dead. He was camping up there. All right, after I loot this guy, I'm actually gonna run back to base because I'm gonna be full of loot. Oh, there it is. Okay. And he has a... Another release bag. He has a bunch of items. Actually, he had a saber tooth and another chainsaw. All right, he's dead. I think he was naked. I, I don't think he had anything, actually. Back in base, successfully depoted everything. That was a really, really good run, actually. He's dead. Seems like he was full military. All right, and he has, by the looks of it, some ammo, some raw. Saber too. He has a high box, actually. That's pretty good. He has some metal as well. We could take that. Trying to get crafting trees, so then we could start making lockers as well. Yo, there's a detonator as well. That's actually what I've been looking for this whole time. All right, well, I'm gonna run back to base. I'm gonna make charges. I do have quite a ton of raw. I do have quite a ton of grenades. And I do know two bases. One of them is very close to here, and the other one is very close to the helicopter. So we do have some bases to raid anyway. Trying to get crafting three. I already got crafting one. And there's a guy there. He almost killed me. He had a, had a Zubeknikov. I didn't think he actually had a gun, to be honest. Alright, and he has Zubeknikov, rock explosive, some ammo. So I've been farming a ton of trees. I did pick up the wood, and I'm actually going to use it for upgrading the base. Got myself a 2x2 two two now. Got myself some more storage as well. And now, next what I'm going to do is I'm going to craft as much C4 as possible, and we're going to go and do those base raids. Now, probably not going to be solo either. I think Nicole is going to join me and help me out a bit. Alright, so I got 5 charges and a detonator, and we're gonna head over to the first base raid. Now, I do have another charge here. Actually, I'm gonna take it. So this is the first raid we're going to do. It's a 2 by two. Part of it is metal, part of it is wood. So I'm gonna guess that where the metal is, it's where the main loot is. Um, I think we can't actually get through. There's a bunch of food by the looks of it. Can we actually go inside? No, I think we have to break these wardrobe. And I think Nicole fell in. And I think she's actually stuck. I'm gonna place a charge there and hopefully this doesn't damage her. She literally can't get out. Yeah, she made it. And, oh my, actually, there's a lot of load. Okay, a PDW. These guys are stacked, actually. Oh my god, there's so much raw. Take all of those. So much charges right over there. There's a bunch of guns, a bunch of metal. There's another PDW. A bunch of glue as well. These guys were actually geared. I didn't expect this to be this good. We could take the Shadow Stalker and its rails, because we could technically raid with that. Maybe we could do run, could run back to base, depot. Hopefully nobody will find this base raid, though. All right, time to run back to base and depot. Uh, we actually are geared full of charges. We got so much. I'm really happy with our progress next we're gonna go back to the base that we just raided we're gonna take whatever we left we didn't really leave anything that important but we did leave some extra guns i'm pretty sure we left a nikarev as well and then after that we're gonna take all of these charges and we're gonna go and raid that base the second base the full metal base that i saw hopefully that one would be even better than this one all right time to build up gonna assume that the base is probably claimed but if it's not that would actually be so much better all right let's check got ourselves seven yeah it's fully claimed but it's actually not that claimed from over here so the claim flag must be at the very back of all right yeah we actually not gonna need that much plates to be honest and we're on top of it all right so i do have myself enough charges hopefully the base is full metal so it's gonna take us quite a ton there's three charges to actually go in 
looks like we broke a doorway there's some lockers in there more lockers now we gotta make sure that like we don't get stuck i mean you could technically go out on top of the vault door all right well there's some eagle fires a yuri nothing that insane though bunch of food and ace blowtorch some meds i could take those some more food well we're gonna blow these up then hopefully some good loot and hopefully these charges are worth it because i have four charges after this and here we go oh okay and we could actually go out that's good all right okay a, a rocket launcher rocket another charge another detonate dragon fang oh my god nitrate there there's another detonator down there oh my god there's so much grenades we can make a heart beacon if we want to okay so we got a dragon fang that's actually the best thing that we've got probably fully decked out as well oh there's a dragon fang box down there all right, let me pick up the detonator and i'll go back up that's oh, a full moon as well we could actually go farm if we want to all right let's raid these locker and this one has a high cal box two heartbreakers and a zodiac this one has a bunch of raw okay all right and we are through Flame. oh there's two more all right this was a four-man team then and this one has a steely and a raw looks like it had a bunch of raw a bunch of more raw good Oh, this one broke. And a bunch of guns. Peacemakers and a saber tooth. That's it. Yeah, we're gonna run back to base depot and then we'll return. We are back in base depot with everything. Now what I'm gonna take with me is the rocket launcher, the charges, and the dragon fang. Cole actually had the dragon fang box that we got. She got from the base raid and she picked it up. I thought I did. All right, and we are back. And we are through. Looks like there's actually a bunch of more wardrobes. Crossbow and the monster key. Yeah, all right. Well, there are still... There's a Zubek over here. All right, now I'm gonna use charges for these wardrobes over here. The floor broke. There was some loot actually, yeah, a bunch of loads, some elite specs, there's a spec ops helmet. Alright, and we are back in. And yeah, well they did. There's a bunch of loot on the ground. A bunch of guns. There's some raw. There's another Grizz Metamoris as well. Yeah, more lockers. Hopefully this doesn't kill us actually. Yeah, it won't. Alright, first rocket. Second rocket. Yeah, they all broke, looks like. Bunch of more loot. Grizzly, another nitrator, a bunch of high cal. Break the claim flag. Alright, this one broke. It looks like it has a bunch of guns. Steely and the calling card Echo Metal Yeah, this was actually a really really good raid Alright everybody, that's going to be it for this video Now after that we went back to base and then left the server This was a really fun raid to do Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one Bye